My name is Scott Memhart. I'm the president and general manager here at Cape Pond Ice Company. I've been here since 1983, so 33 years. My dad and I formed a group to buy the Cape Pond Ice Company from the retiring son and son-in-law of the former owners, and today my son works with us as well, but uh, our, our family is the fifth family group to own the Cape Pond Ice Company since it was founded in the year 1848 here in Gloucester and founded to serve the fishing industry's needs for a reliable source of supply of ice to keep the fish fresh. So we're here on Cape Pond Ice Company's wharf, uh, which is where the uh, Andrea Gale pulled in in 1991, October. She took 20 tons of ice here at Cape Pond Ice Company back then. She was out for a long trip and she had her own onboard ice baking machine which allowed them to stay out as long as they did. Unfortunately for them the machine broke down, the perfect storm caught up with them and without the ice to preserve the value of their catch they needed to try and get back to Canada and Gloucester um, while they still had enough ice to keep the, their fish fresh. You know, the ice is cheap but without it the value of their fish is going to deteriorate very quickly. We, we played a, an element in the, in the storyline of The Perfect Storm. Warner Brothers uh, followed up on that after Sebastian Younger was successful in writing his account. Uh, we sold 100 t-shirts and 100 caps to Warner Brothers with our Cape Pond Ice Coolest Guys logo. And uh, the rest is history. The Perfect Storm has been a blockbuster film. Now we have Wicked Tuna here in Gloucester, the Nat Geo program, and TJ Ott and uh, Dave Marciano are pulling in here to get their ice to keep their tuna fresh. And we trade tuna steaks for a uh, Cape Pond Ice t-shirt with them, which is great. Since the perfect storm, we've offered a Cape Pond Ice Historic Ice House Tour. We've always been an art center and a tourism center, and we offer it typically twice a day during the summer. We talk about the history of our own Cape Pond Ice Company and the five families that have operated it over the last 160 years. And then because the movie itself is a down note to end our tour at the Ice House on, we, we have our own TV commercials, which are a little more upbeat and tend to send people on their way uh, with a smile on their faces, and they're are all primed to make sure to ask their waiter or waitress that this is Cape Pond ice that's in their water glass at one of our local Gloucester restaurants and not you know, some imitation uh, made in the back room. So.